hi guys welcome 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 to my channel and welcome to another vlog if you're new here my name is emily if you are a returning subscriber you friend i'm a favorite person and you don't even know it yet so as we speak i'm headed out i want to go and get my nails done my appointment is at one so i'm here to submit the outfit of the day as well as the scent of the day i laid my edges today child and i saw what you all talk about it sure does make a difference so for the outfit of the day i'm wearing this jeans jacket that i thrifted either at gikosh or at chica's thrifted this top at nairobi west jeans are from chica as usual boots are from forever trendy and that's my gucci dionysus bag and yeah that's the outfit of the day this is the watch that i bought a while back i went very simple i'm not wearing any makeup i just powdered my face put on some lip gloss and just wing it i don't feel like doing a face beat as for the scent of the day i'm wearing i'm wearing baccarat rouge 540 and kanaisha kiamungu do you know <laughs> This thing costs almost 50,000. I think it's 43k for 75 ml or 100 ml. I'm not sure. So when you spray it first, in case I've never mentioned this, when you first put this on, it smells like a hospital. But when it dries down, that's where the real deal is. When it dries down, it's such a head turner. So yeah, that's that. Let me go and get my nails done. So guys, I am back home. I got my nails done. I got a blush color with a hint of French on the middle fingers. So that is the nail set for this month. And I am not as tired as I'd expect to be, but I am freezing. So yesterday I made the silly mistake of wearing sandals when I went to do my grocery shopping. So when I came back home, I was literally, literally freezing. Today is no exception, but it's better than yesterday. So before I could do anything else, I made myself a hot cup of green mint tea. And from town, I got um, my monthly meat supply from Danica. It's at City Market and it's halal if you'd want to buy uh, meat from there. I also got... Do you know, do you know I've left the stuff I got from Home Deco in town? I think I left it at Chica's place. And, and speaking of Chica, he got me lunch, which is a two pizza sticky with coleslaw. So this is what I'm going to have for dinner. So I'm going to change into something warm and cozy and then sleep. And I'll see you guys tomorrow, I suspect. The plant guys will be the one to wake me up because I did exchange my pots for my palm tree. So usually they deliver very early in the morning. So I suspect how do you I just keep buying deco stuff for the console table other than the console table, but I'll get it soon enough. So see you guys tomorrow. Let me have a dinner. What is this? It's thighs, coleslaw fries and a two pizza mm, this is a bit dirty so let me just warm it up and i'll see you guys tomorrow good morning guys i was right i've just been woken up by the plant delivery guy so let me show you the new pot for the palm plant it looks like that it's green color they didn't have white and have preferred white but i'll take gray so i want to vacuum this carpet over here 
as well as that one over there it's my dining table one so usually when i vacuum i tend to get nauseated so i think i'll just vacuum and wait for an hour or two or so so that i can make breakfast because i won't be able to eat or drink anything until the nauseated feeling goes away i don't think that's grammatically correct but anywho, that's what I want to do. I want to vacuum my carpets and chill for an hour, then have breakfast. So guys, what was meant to be a maximum 30 minute vacuum sesh turned out to be a whole cleaning session for a house that was cleaned on Thursday. Anyway, so I've just finished cleaning. So most of the time after I finish cleaning, I tend to get very dehydrated. Thank God the nauseated feeling is gone. So I'm drinking a butter of water. So after cleaning, the next uh, step is to make the house smell good. So let's do that. So these right here were my tools of trade. If you don't do anything else in this vlog, please purchase these. This takes off grease in literally minutes. And this one is another thing that I believe. Actually, I believe in this product more than I believe in my own dreams. It's the taco oven cleaner. You splash kidogo on your oven um, on, uh, or on top of your stoves, especially if they're discolored. I'd recommend these. This takes care of that uh, discoloring. And then this is the floor cleaner that I used. And I also cleaned the bathroom, guys. Yo, uh, uh, Emily. You know, my family even makes fun of me because I clean a lot. And of course, I disinfected because what's the point of cleaning without disinfecting? So to make my house smell good, I'm going to spray these in the curtains. I talked about these scented spray in my previous grocery haul. So let's test it out. First step is to turn this on. Focus, focus. This is the Bath and Body Works Wallflower. It's in the scent Mahogany Teakwood. So you turn this on and then you leave it uh, on for like one hour. And it gives your house such, such a beautiful scent. Next up is uh, the curtains using this scented spray. So, you, oops, I almost sprayed to myself. So... And then I interchange the diffuser sticks like that. And that's it. It's currently at 12.30. So that means I'll have my breakfast at 1. All because I wanted a cleaner house than it was. So yeah, let me make breakfast. And I'll talk to you guys as I'm having breakfast. So I've just made my breakfast. I'm having samosa, bacon, scrambled eggs, avocado. This is samoon bread that I grilled with just a blue band and a sausage. I'm trying to finish these sausages. Let me pick something else. So I add salsa kachumbari to my eggs. All right. So just one teaspoon one tablespoon i mean not one teaspoon and then i'm not going to have coffee or tea because it's past uh, 12 
So instead, what I'm going to have is uh, Alvaro. Hey, hey, clink, 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 clink. So that is my breakfast for today. And this is a red wine glass, but the rules don't apply when you're at home. And also full, full, full glass because rules still don't apply. So yeah, that is my breakfast for today. I'll skip right through lunch and then I'll have a dinner. I have some leftover nyam chum that I'll have with ugali and probably spinach. So yeah. So the stuff that I left yesterday, tao is here so the first thing that i got from town is of course la roche posay effacla duo this is what uh, helps get rid of uh, dark marks and then i got a frame i told you guys i keep buying i keep buying stuff for now i need scissors I, is that what you're trying to say that i need to pick a pair of scissors i okay let me get let me get a pair of scissors. I'm going to use my kitchen scissors because they were the nearest. So I was saying I keep buying deco for the console table, but I haven't yet gotten the console table. Mainly because I want to do the measurements uh, approximately so that I don't overestimate or underestimate. So I got this frame. This is basically the theme of my house, white, black, gray. And yeah, so I got this. This will be somewhere under there with uh, these coffee deco books. This was 900 plus the frame. And then these I usually get for, how much is this? 2060 if I'm not wrong. And I usually repurchase like after two or three months depending on usage. So the other thing is this coffee deco book. It's of course Chanel darling because Chanel is rare to find. <laughs> but anyway, I got uh, this one. This will also be on the console table and I'm thinking of adding like half the length of this and half the width. Could be Vogue, could be not Tom, could be Tom Ford as well. I don't mind. So yeah, that was the stuff that I got yesterday in town. So I now want to go and um, take a shower and I might skip dinner, who knows, the night is still young, but we shall see. So let me carry on with the night. Guys, I have decided to cook, so I'm going to make ugali with that spinach and I have some leftover yam chom. So that is what I'm going to have for dinner today. And that is dinner for today, ugali, spinach leftover nyam chom, avocado and a glass of red wine so i'll see you guys tomorrow good morning i just woke up today is sunday it's impossible to vlog in this house on sunday because uh, there are churches around so usually on sundays is when i edit i have two videos to edit which is what i'm going to do but I also want to go to Okadeko. I woke up, woke up thinking about uh, Okadeko. So I'm just going to see what they have. I'm going all the way to Two Rivers and then come back and uh, edit. And hopefully there'll be a video tomorrow, Monday by 10 a.m. So I don't think I'm going to have breakfast. I'm just going to have a cup of coffee in Dionyamke, Nonata Uso Imefura. And that's that. So let me have coffee, take a shower, and then head out to Okadeko. So for breakfast, I'm having a toasted bread avocado, 
Vienna's and plantain and a cup of coffee and that is my breakfast for today okay so i'm ready to step out and go to okadeko i'm wearing this uh sky blue leather jacket fox jacket not leather jacket from chica this t-shirt that i got from kairetu's apparel the sweatpants are from toy market and i'm trying to decide if i should wear this or that but i think i'm going to wear this it looks well paired up like that i'm not wearing any makeup i'm just going to go like that and my scent of the day is um should i show you yeah I should show you as i take my bag for the day so my scent for the day is Le Bras by Yves Saint Laher and my bag for the day is that one next to the red one, the Gucci Dionysus Dionysus. So sorry for the background noise but let me head out now. hello guys i didn't vlog much today i came in straight yesterday from two rivers came back home and edited the two videos that went up today as a matter of fact i'm just from reading your comments and i can see you guys are asking for a house tour house tour <laughs> let me just be honest with you i honestly don't think i can hold a camera and tell you this is my kitchen this is my living room i feel like because i mostly vlog in my house i kind of low-key give you a house tour so please bear with me i'm not comfortable doing a house tour but if there's anything you get a glimpse of and you're curious why i got it just let me know in the comment section and i'll tell you guys where i got it from so i didn't even do a haul of the stuff that i got because I've been working today and I'm actually going to be working late in the night as soon as I am done with this haul. So the stuff that I got from Okadeko is this magazine rack. I don't remember the price, but I think it was... Do I have the receipt here? What's my car for receipt? Where is my Okadeko receipt, child? Where is it? Will it be here? Okay, I don't know where I took the receipt, but I got this magazine rack. This will be down there with the rope basket that I usually put my fleece blankets. So for the console table, I want it to be partitioned uh, at the top twice and then chini, no partitioning. So on the right part is this magazine rack. On the left part is the rope basket with the fleece blanket. I also got these wine dispensers because usually when I open my wine, I have to leave the top seal part to cover my wine. But these will help going forward and I can just pour it from this top here. Works like an oil dispenser actually. So got these for 272. Oh, I've actually remembered the prices are usually somewhere down here. I got this magazine holder for 2190. The next item were these coasters. I love, 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 love the message on this coaster. I think I should do it like that. Says when life gives you lemons, make lemonade. So I got this for 380. A set of one, two, three, four, five, six, a dozen actually. So yeah, such a steal. And then I got this vase. This is what I was actually going to get at Okadeko. Oh my god, oh my god, I almost destroyed the the upper part of this. Right. 
Did I cut it? No, I didn't cut it. Thank God. Allah. So yeah, this is the verse that I was going to get. I got this for 1760 Again, I keep purchasing stuff for the console table and now I'm ready. I'm actually ready to get the console table. I'm going to stock this with um, fluffy pampas grass, which will be on the, on the right part of the top part of my console table. So yeah, this is actually what I wanted to go and get as well as the magazine holder the other stuff that i got was <laughs> i actually loved this glass and when i went to okadeko the last time i was there i think i did a haul for that in a vlog i saw this wine glass i didn't oh, i didn't feel like picking it up but ilini haunt hey you know how you're haunted by things you wanted to get and then you don't get them and then when you now want to get them they're sold out thank god this wasn't sold out so this is a wine glass this one i can even take water with because how will i know nobody's gonna know nobody's gonna know it's water in here <laughs> anyway these sure. So this cute wine glass looks like that on the inside and it looks like that on the outside. I got it for 520 shillings. I almost got another measuring jug but the Lord held me. And then I passed by Carrefour, the Two Rivers one. I got, uh... oh no, 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 no. The last item from Okadeko is this beautiful, beautiful soy dish but i'm not going to use it for soy dish this is what i'm going to do when i have a, a guest over or so i plan on putting different sauces here on my food like tomato sauce and chili sauce there or some nice dip there and a sauce there so i got two of those and each went for 90 shillings so that's the stuff that i got at uh, okadeko Passed by Kafo and first thing up, I saw these uh, these masks, the ones with that cap there on the top, black in color because get into it, girl, get into it. You're not buying blue masks. I got this tropical heat fireball with the grinder, and I finally got the clothes. This time, I didn't confuse with uh, nutmeg. And then, oh my goodness, I found my mug. Oh, I was so happy. I was jumping like a kid who's just been bought a toy in the supermarket. So this is the mug that I tried to replace at Carrefour. They have when I was doing my grocery haul, but I found it. I found it at Two Rivers. So this mug, and they were plenty actually. Got this for 440 shillings. And then... Last but nowhere near least, I got mint. I got mint. I don't know why I haven't stored this in the fridge yet. And then I got this taco oven cleaner. My other one is almost finished and I believe in this cleaner. So yeah, that's the mini haul for Okadeko. And now I'm going to clean this glass and have a cup of coffee with a leftover chicken fingers that I have and a minced meat sandwich. So... I'll see you guys later on. And since I'm trying everything out, this is how I break things by the way. Give you a two. I'm going to grind in some chili there and a little bit there. So that is that. So leftover fish fingers. This is a canned tomato sauce, choma sauce, avocado, and a sandwich and a minced beef bread sandwich so that is my dinner for today and before <laughs> i think i'm first going to watch real housewives of potoma i think uh, there was an episode last night so i'm going to watch that and then start working immediately and chinner came i was like 
want to be the Black Martha Stewart. Okay. I want to do like towels. Guys, it's 1.23. I am so, so happy that I've been able to work on that file and finish what needed to be done. Of course, this is not to glorify overworking or working late at night, but this was something that I needed to do. If I set myself to do something, I can't sleep until I've done it. The only thing that was keeping me company was the neighboring dogs and of course music. But I am so, so happy because I think I am a bit free for the week. Just a few emails here and there and I'm free. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. I made a quick breakfast as I wait for them to pump water so that I can take a shower. So that is my breakfast. Double bagging the tea bags today. I'm having green lemon tea with lemongrass and I'm having doma, plantain, bacon, chicken tikka, samosas, um, viennas and one last thing. And I did toast my bread. Where do I put this? Hey, <laughs> this is a heavy, heavy breakfast. So yeah, that is my breakfast for today. I will skip right through lunch. I'll probably have grapes or yogurt and then for dinner I plan on having barbecued wings with fries. So let me have my breakfast. So guys, I took a shower and I've changed into this cute uh, mustard jumpsuit. I want to go and bomoa this nyuele. Nyuele angu bomo karaka. So I'm headed out to the salon just um, around the bomoa. And then wig life is back. So let me show you the salon outfit. So there goes my jumpsuit. I got it at uh, Queen's Classic Collections for you'll never believe it. 1,000 shillings. So it was demoted. It used to be for going places. You remember when we were kids, the way we used to say, Hini akwenda mahali. <laughs> so it used to be such type of uh, an outfit, but it was demoted because it chomekad somewhere there. So yeah, let me go to the salon and put back the wig. Although I feel like I look cute with these long braids like this in the hat. Who knows? I might braid again in a month or so. So and I am back. There's inches, darling. <laughs> uh, from the goodhairstudio.ke. I changed into something uh, warm and cozy. So I'm wearing a hoodie and sweats, of course. And I decided I'm not going to cook. So I ordered food from uh, a nearby restaurant. I munched some of it while at the salon. So it was beef stew with fries and of course nimekula nyama. So now I'm going to make mint tea and have it with uh, these fries over here. So in case I don't talk to you guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning guys. I woke up and decided to clean as well as uh, answer a few emails. So I'm having breakfast at 12. I'm having mm, a coffee mix small small coffee mix i'm going to add a uh, caramel syrup to it just a little bit not too much yep and i'm also having um a glass of juice or some juice this is a blend of watermelon pineapple i added in two sweet bananas so that it's not too thin i also added in just two leaves of mint and I also added in half a bottle of uh, aqua mist peach water and I also added in just one uh, orange squeeze. So I'm going to have a blunt hot dog as usual. Look at the mess that I just did. And, and uh, plantain. So hot dog, plantain. Chicken tikka, samosas, coffee, and juice. And then this is uh, wings. Wings are my favorite. 
I'm just marinating them for a few hours. They're going to be barbecued wings and fries and we'll see if I have the grace to do a vegetable, a veggie mix. So the recipe for this is on a previous vlog captioned so. Okay, so I baked the wings and I'm having uh, an early dinner. It's exactly at uh, 6. I made a quick uh, salad to accompany it and fries as well. The salad is just uh, carrots, red onion, cucumber and capsicum. And then I added a little bit of salt and this is the juice that I made earlier on. So that is my dinner for today and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Good morning guys. I woke up early today, worked on a few things and now it's time for breakfast. I am having a bland hot dog as usual, baked beans, bacon, plantain, chicken tikka samosas and grapes and a cappuccino. I posted this as a reel on my Instagram. So yeah, that is my breakfast for today. Hello guys. I want to make quick uh, fries. I have some leftover wings and a salad from yesterday. So shout out to my cleaning lady for making sure I didn't step outside today to go and buy potatoes because what is this weather job? And that is my dinner leftovers from yesterday with fries sauce and cheers hello guys good morning today is a Friday thank God it's Friday oh God it's really... you're looking fine you're looking fine <laughs> anyway I am headed out I'm going to my friend she recently became a mom of two and i'm going to visit her and her little one in true emily fashion this is when i'm going to buy her gifts so i'm going to pass by biashara street i'm also going to get her flowers because i know nothing about babies i can't risk shopping for her in the supermarket so i'll go to biashara street and they'll guide me on what to get for her so let me submit to the outfits of the day because you know <laughs> Oh, this look is giving it's giving what it's supposed to give child <laughs> anyway for the outfit of the day okay so shoes are from backyard shoes they are ankle boots jeans as always are from chica this blouse i thrifted when i was in campus still love it one of my favorites and leather jacket is from chica as usual and my bag of the day is this louis vuitton and hair as always is from the good hair studio.ke focus my scent of the day is rose and roses by Miss Dior darling okay get into it and that's the fit of the day It is half past seven, hi from me and my oily face as usual. I am back, I am a bit exhausted, but I had a good time with my friend. I'm too lazy to cook, I'm too lazy to take off my makeup, I'm too lazy to take off these clothes and change into something warm and cozy. So the only thing that I've done was make a cup of cappuccino guys in the end we all become our parents like who's this girl taking coffee at this time of the night and i also ordered pizza this is a barbecue steak and this is what i'm going to have for dinner and i'll see you guys tomorrow
Good afternoon, guys. Hey, this is when I'm having breakfast. I woke up at 10 and I feel very, very well rested. So it was deliberate to wake up at 10 and now I'm having breakfast, which is the same old, just a different day. A bland hot dog as usual, plantain, chicken tikka samosas, grapes, and fresh juice. And that is what I'm going to have for breakfast today. I had forgotten I have leftover pizza from yesterday, so I've added that in. And that is going to be my breakfast. For dinner, I think I'll have gideri. I'm really, really craving gideri. So with that, allow me to end this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and thank you for always supporting my channel, my little channel, ciao. And I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.